In medical news today, every year approximately one million Americans undergo a procedure to open up their blocked arteries in their hearts using stents. While the procedure has typically been done going through an artery in the groin, some doctors are now perfecting a brand new technique that may make stenting a little faster and even safer. Here's how. When Maurice Scapinato's doctors told him he needed surgery to clear blocked arteries to his heart, he dreaded the idea of a hospital stay. I thought I'd be there for a few days. In fact, Maurice was in and out within hours. It was easier than going to the dentist. <laughs> it was. Cleveland Clinic cardiologist Dr. Howard Bush is following a growing trend of performing this procedure through an artery in the wrist rather than an artery in the groin. Well, it's a much smaller artery, so the risk of bleeding is basically zero. And we have uh, closure devices or techniques to stop the bleeding once the procedure's over. In many cases, with this approach, patients can go home the same day. The advantage for the patient is they sleep in their own bed, the advantage for the hospital, it's more efficient utilization of resources. Dr. Bush believes heart surgeons will soon be using the wrist as an access site for any number of surgical interventions. This can lead to uh, repair of carotid arteries. We now do carotid stenting and that can be accessed through the wrist. Uh, we can do peripheral vascular disease, which is the blood vessels to the legs. We can uh, put balloons and stents in kidney arteries if they're contributing to high blood pressure. And I think we're going to see a whole new wave of treatment options for patients with high blood pressure. And the risk may be a great uh, access site. Now, in order to be a candidate for this wrist approach to cardiac stenting, patients need to have really good circulation in that area. Right now, only about 5% of surgeons in the U.S. utilize the wrist for cardiac stenting. And many surgeons still feel more confident with the tried and true approach of going through the groin.